Hi team, this is Emma from GDN Fitness and Hockey. I'm going to take you through how to use the Team Builder app. Load up the Team Builder app and you will see your workout for the day. If you click on an exercise, you will see the option to input your weight lifted and your repetitions. This information is vital to track progress and ensure progressive overload throughout the weeks. If you head to the top right of the screen, you will see a green history button. On this screen, you will see all your previous workout results for that particular exercise. The left number represents the weight lifted and the right is your number of repetitions. If we exit that screen, you will also see a red button in the top right corner, which is the video button. If you click on this button, you will be taken to a video on how to perform the exercise with the correct technique. Coming out of the video, and if I can draw your attention to the bottom right corner, you will see a yellow journal button. This feature allows you to make notes on how well you performed the exercise. For example, if your right leg was more stable than your left in a split squat. Further to this, in the bottom left hand corner, you will see a paperclip icon. This allows you to upload a video. This is a useful tool to monitor your technique progress throughout the weeks and allows your coach to also see the form so that they can give feedback. The final button on this screen is the opt-in and opt-out button in the bottom left corner. If for some reason you aren't able to complete an exercise, whether it's lack of equipment or time for example, this feature allows you to make a note saying that you opted out or replaced it with an alternative exercise. I'll now draw your attention to the very top right corner where you'll see a calendar icon. If you click on this, you will see the current month. The dots next to the date represent workouts, the red meaning incomplete workouts, the green meaning complete, and amber meaning it's partly complete. If you click on a date, it will show you the workout for the day. The next important feature is messages, which you will see in the very bottom right. If you click there, it will show you all of your current messages and allow you to message your coach or teammates by pressing the green plus button. If you have any questions regarding your program, this feature will allow you to chat directly to your coach. And finally, for our teams, there is a team feed located in the bottom left. This tells you all the important information about your team's performance, such as personal bests, as well as any announcements about your program from your coach. So that's the Team Builder app. If you do have any questions, you can ask us directly through the messages section or feel free to email us on hello at teamgdn.com.